Your hotel keycard contains zero actual data about your room, yet somehow it still unlocks the exact right door every single time. Here's what's wild. That little plastic card has no battery, no processor, and no clue what your room number is. It just holds a tiny RFID chip that responds when hit with the right radio frequency. When you tap the card on the lock, the lock's reader sends out power wirelessly using electromagnetic induction. That powers up the chip just enough to send back a short UID, a unique identification code. But that UID alone doesn't do much. The real brain is inside the lock. Each door lock has a built-in microcontroller and local memory. When you check in, the system syncs your card's UID to that room's lock through a central access control server or via a staff programmer. That lock then remembers, hey, this UID is allowed in here until 11 a.m. Thursday. No room number on the card, no Wi-Fi in the card. Just a passive handshake verified locally. Okay, but couldn't I just scan someone's card and make a clone? Boom, free penthouse. Old hotel systems? Maybe. But modern setups use encrypted RFID tech like MyFair, Desfire, EV2, or HID SEOs. The UID might be static, but the authentication involves cryptographic challenge response. Some even rotate keys or use rolling codes. And here's the kicker. The locks log every access attempt and can be remotely wiped if the system flags suspicious behavior. So even if you cloned a card, you're basically playing with a digital self-destructing grenade. Man, I just wanted extra towels. Not a felony. Thanks for crushing my hotel dreams, nerd. Want more tech breakdowns that make the real world make sense? Follow for more.